Distinguished members of the audience. Today, I come before you to shed light on a distressing truth that deeply rattles the essence of our collective existence. We assemble today to face an unspeakable atrocity, the intentional employment of hunger as a tool of warfare, directed towards the defenseless residents of Gaza. In the meantime to address a deeply troubling and urgent matter, the grave human rights violations committed against the Palestinian people, particularly in the Gaza Strip. These atrocities, perpetrated by Israeli forces, demand our attention, our outrage, and our collective action. Amidst the besieged Gaza Strip, where hope flickers delicately, the Israeli government has masterminded a heartless and strategic operation. Their aim? To strip civilians of the essential elements vital for survival, food, water, and fuel. Envision the heart-wrenching torment of a mother, incapable of nourishing her famished child, the hopeless agony of a father witnessing his loved ones endure hardship, and the unspoken pleas of infants who only grasp the concept of hunger. This grim existence is all too prevalent among the countless Palestinians residing in Gaza. It is no secret that top Israeli officials, including Defense Minister Yov Gallant, National Security Minister Itamar Bengver, and Energy Minister Israel Katz, have been quite vocal about their intentions. Their stated objective is none other than the deliberate deprivation of essential resources for the civilian population in Gaza. The actions of Israeli forces serve as concrete evidence, rather than empty rhetoric, as they deliberately obstruct the delivery of water, food, and fuel, hinder humanitarian aid efforts, and destroy agricultural lands. Crucial resources necessary for survival are intentionally denied. I urge you to lend an ear to the voices of the suffering. Displaced Palestinians vividly portray the difficulties they face, enduring days lacking basic provisions like food, electricity, and internet access. They recount the relentless quest for survival amid challenging circumstances, along with the unnerving uncertainty that looms over their very existence. According to the United Nations World Food Programme, approximately 90% of households in northern Gaza and around two-thirds of households in southern Gaza have experienced a complete day and night without any food. Remaining silent is not an option. The intentional employment of hunger as a tool of warfare flagrantly disregards the principles enshrined in international humanitarian law. This heinous act against humanity inflicts lasting wounds on future generations. As responsible citizens of the world, we must insist on holding individuals accountable. We need to implore global leaders to vehemently denounce this deplorable behavior. The collective voice of our conscience insists on immediate action. From October 7, 2023, Israeli military has apprehended more than 2,200 Palestinian individuals within the occupied West Bank. Alarmingly, the count of Palestinians subjected to administrative detention, being held without any charges or trial, has escalated from 1,319 to 2,070 throughout this duration. The individuals under detention have suffered from harsh physical assault, degradation, and deplorable treatment. The Israeli forces compel them to lower their heads, kneel during headcounts, and even perform songs of Israeli origin. These practices blatantly infringe upon the fundamental dignity and rights of these individuals. Amidst the turmoil, Palestinian women and girls residing in Gaza have been subjected to appalling acts of violence. According to reports, these individuals have been ruthlessly killed by invading Israeli defense forces, sometimes in the presence of their children, without any apparent reason, despite their attempt to signal surrender by displaying white pieces of fabric. These instances of violence cannot be seen as isolated events but rather form a consistent pattern of mistreatment, where vulnerable Palestinian women are subjected to sexual assault and rape as tools of warfare. The unjustifiable actions of Israeli authorities, such as the summary killings, torture, and arbitrary detention of Gaza civilians, are completely unacceptable and should not be granted any form of justification. The unsettling resemblance between the actions of Israeli forces and the Zionist gangs during the 1948 Nakba is undeniable. The deliberate acts of murder, destruction of property, infliction of torture, and utter humiliation are disconcertingly similar tactics employed both in the past and present times. Silence is not an option, we must speak up, urging for answers and fighting tirelessly to ensure justice prevails. It is imperative that the international community acknowledges the immense suffering endured by Palestinian individuals, regardless of gender or age, and take significant measures to break free from the vicious cycle of violence and oppression. We should always remember that empathy transcends all boundaries and united, we shall confront the forces attempting to snuff out the flame of existence. In the name of our shared humanity, we declare with unwavering determination, no more. No more pain. No more hunger. No more hushed voices. Thank you.